Welcome back, everybody, to FNF Bar Talk. Me and Naked Araba here again tonight with another, not really a drink review video, but kind of like an old school mixer. Kind of like a playback. From on... the early 2000s. Yep. So I mentioned before on a couple of the other Smirnoff tastes that we've done. So, and I, I, I use the term back in the day a lot, but uh, back in the day. So <clears throat> early 2000s, back when people actually went to clubs and had a good time, left the house, you know, and all that kind of good stuff and mingled with people. We'd go out. Now, initially, there was this other drink that, that used to be kind of really big, popular for a short time out there. This is basically called Sky Blue. For those of you that are, you know, a little older, you know, the Gen Xers and whatnot, you, I'm sure you guys know about the Sky Blue. Pretty much went away um, late 90s. A lot of these type of drinks were starting to come out. You had uh, Doc Otis, Hard Mikes, all that kind of good stuff. Um, Sky Blue came out. It was really good. Think of it like a really mild Smirnoff ice. It was just really good. It came in a nice little blue bottle, whole nine. So eventually, for some reason, they stopped making it or just, you know, disappeared. So experimenting a little bit basically you take original smirnoff ice and you take a, a shot of the blue carousel and boom there you go it's a sky blue you just take a little bit of swig out shot thumb it over boom there you go and it was party down all the way all through the night yeah so uh the original smirnoff it's four and a half percent alcohol 174 calories and 25.5 carbs per bottle for nutritional facts. Mm -hmm. And then you're going to put in some nice sugar. More sugar. Blue sugar. So, yeah, like he said, you drink a little bit down. Just enough to fill, make enough room for the shot to go down. Yeah, that sounds really good. Oh, that's good. <clears throat> and then that's you take good that's good. Yep. a little shot. bit of this. In you go. Thumb it over. Kind of like almost you do with like a Corona with a lime. Just kind of give it a little bit of a shake. Haven't, oh. had, haven't had these in like 15 years. Yes. Man, that is good. That, that brings back a lot of memories from... Oh, yeah. This... Down at the clubs. This will get you in trouble. <clears throat> Let me tell you. Yeah. You know, thinking about it with all the flavors that Smirnoff has, I'm almost kind of wondering if they have something that is similar in tasting to this. I mean, we've tried a couple of them already, and they're not like this, but I don't know. I'll have to keep an eye out. But I'm also always keeping an eye out for Sky Blue. So any of our subscribers that, you know, various states that you're in, if you see... Sky blue, basically it's a blue bottle, sky blue, not the vodka. Uh, it's a malt. It's just like these. Yeah, it's just basically like this. It's like a malt drink, but it's like a bottle wrapped in blue, sky blue. I'll leave a, I'll leave a picture uh, in the video. I'll add it in there. And um, there was another one we used to drink. That I... Don't think they make it anymore. It was UV blue. Remember that? Ah, they that's were, the one that we got from the from Total Wine. Yes, they were really good. That one was really good. Very, very comparable to <clears throat> Sky Blue. Then they just stopped making them. They were just gone. Yep. Don't know why. Just couldn't find them anymore. Anywhere you went, gone. Yeah. So, mm. yeah, it's mm. like a little Memories. retro throwback. If you guys uh, ever get bored one day, give this a shot. Um, anybody who had the sky blue back in the day, give it a shot and, um, you know, leave a comment. Let us know what you think. This is really good. Like you said, it's, it's really dangerous. You can, um, oh yeah, it you just, can, you can suck back 12 of these things. No problem. Basically the carousel takes away a little bit of the carbonation straight from that. And it's just like, boom, it's like, I'd say like soda. It just bow, down. It goes, goes down quick. Yeah. It's kind of like a Sprite. Mm-hmm. Sprite with a little bit of orange with it. It's really good. So, yeah, if you guys want to try something new, yep, give it a shot. Let yep. us know what you think. I'm trying to bring a little old school back. So, yep. 
So, smearing off ice. A little bit of uh, blue carousel, which, by the way, a little fun note. Everyone keeps mispronouncing that. I've done it for I don't know how many years. I actually had to make sure I figured out how to pronounce that correctly. Carousel. It's an orange liqueur from the country. Carousel. So, there you go. A little fun fact. When you're back there kicking out guys, when you want to impress the ladies, give a little history lesson. Hmm. If not, because they, they, they probably don't care. All right, well, that is the uh, retro throwback for this one. So hope you guys enjoyed it. Give it a shot. Give it a try. I think you guys will enjoy it. It's really good. Mm -hmm. um, go ahead and you can, um, you know, hit the subscribe button. If you're not subscribed to the channel, uh, give us a like. We appreciate that. Anything else? Um, no, not really. That's pretty much it. Subscribe, like, try out the concoctions. Um, for any of you... Uh, Gen Xers out there, or even some of the millennials that are out there, if you guys have any kind of little mixers, concoctions, or anything that you know you've done in your party days, hit us up. Let yeah. us know. I'd love to try. Leave a comment. We'll try it out. We'll make yep. it. See what it's all about. Put them up here. Love it, hate it. We'll put it up. Yep. So. All right. Well, you know, always drink responsibly. Do not drink and drive like always. And we will see you guys next time. Yep. See you later.